How's Antenna? No, oh, he's just no playing I with think us. he's just... No, no, it, it Pleasing looks like the it, crowd or the stream here. It looks I, like it's going to be the public turn -up. I have not seen... Another character ever. people think really, really solid in this game. Uh, so yeah, it looks like we're good. Wow, yeah, it. sticking with Palutena here. I haven't seen Zenona's palace. So this is gonna be really interesting um, to see him bring her out. I'm actually super curious as how he plays with her. Um, I mean, terrible. Been rocking the junior or the Wendy, sorry, all the way since Smash Four. Uh, we <coughs> saw him try and play some other characters in the beginning of this game, but it just calls out to him, you know. And it's looking real solid right now. A quick 72% onto Zenodo. Yeah, I mean, definitely. I mean, Wendy is just one of those characters you don't see anymore. I, I usually just see Taternator and Ketchup playing uh, Bowser yeah. Jr. Wendy because uh, those are the only two I see because <laughs> they got some unnecessary um, nerfs, I feel like. You know, yeah, the mean, whole Mecha Koopa. They've been making it work, though. Definitely, yeah. They're definitely both good players, and it's so awesome to see. You know, a low tier character or mid low tier character uh, play well at these events. So this is super cool. Yeah, and right now it looks like Teo's doing a great job of just snuffing out any sort of approach options from Zenodo, using this fair in the back here <laughs> really well to just kind of disc uh, abuse his disjoints. And the back is gonna find that first we'll dog. Teo looking pretty <laughs> solid right now. Excuse me. Yeah, Taternator is doing a really good job of knowing what he needs to do against Palutena um, and how to keep him out and the best way to punish. Um, looking for that down tilt. Pal just goes ahead and grabs him. <laughs> back airs. Back. Yeah. Back throws. <laughs> Sorry. I, I have the water all, jumps all of a sudden over in my throat. <coughs> Not going to let... Uh, Zenodo find any sort of comeback mechanic right now. He's doing a great job of just getting his damage in the nair from Zenodo. Gonna force him off. <coughs> Sorry. Oh my god, I'm coughing up a storm here. Um, <coughs> but yeah, Taternator also putting the pressure on the ledge, trying to read at the get up or call out the jump. <coughs> uh, jumps on the side of the edge of. Wow, just gonna okay. Kill. That killed. Uh, wow, okay, I didn't. Palush. Yeah, her tilts and ne her neutral. It's just so good. Yeah, one thing I would like to see more from Zenodo is that he's, you know, sh whenever the Mecha Koopa comes out, you can shield it for free and it just dies. It yeah. no longer explodes once it hits That's what I mean about the un un one of the unnecessary nerfs. What, like, why nerf yeah. Mecha Koopa? Okay, wait, Jab actually <coughs> is a kill option at the ledge. They're almost finding the kill as early as 90%. Oh, yep, he went ahead and z dropped that, uh, hoping that would connect. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> But right. man, Zonoto is not out of this. N keeps on uh, reading those. Uh, looks like he's getting up at the ledger, jumping and calling it out with Nair. So super. <coughs> this is pretty close. Oh, and the Ooh. spin out gonna find that stock once again. Tato only seeing out about sixty percent with the stock lead. Man, just right. Th this gameplay. They're just right next to each other. Just kind of shielding and trying to. <coughs> connect some type of move here. Yeah, and the Nair right there gonna force uh, Terranair off a of stage. The fair actually gets beat by the spin out, but not that fair. <sighs> wow, good get up uh, fair <coughs> into Palu's face there. Oh, that's a uh, grab. Big Zero Dodge gets another grab. Terranair tries to find his way back to stage, but he doesn't find mm. a successful one. Gonna eat a back here. 50% here for Zenodo, not the worst deficit. Definitely not. Zenodo still can bring this back. Oh, throwing the Mecha Koopa. Was that 20 damage onto Wendy there? I and now all of a sudden this game looking real close for Zenodo. He's able to bring it back to a 20% deficit. He just has to find uh, one or two more hits to even it up. But Tater is not going to let him do that. Tries to jab at the get up attack. Yeah, he's probably it. trying to jab and then um, Honestly, jab wanting to make yeah Zenodo roll roll so he can oh, not even that but that is, like uh, we almost saw earlier it can kill at the ledge maybe at 80 percent it would have i feel like maybe not at 80 i feel like the high 90 percent uh jab will kill oh he Ooh. sniped him with the mecha koopa he uses the jump and he snipes again. him again just does it twice in a row not going to kill let's see she goes for the f smash trying to catch palu's up be there doesn't, doesn't get the two frame though man this is a close game let's see no okay, gonna okay. throw him off stage doesn't get the down throw into the back air How's he going to get off the ledge? He goes for the fair. 
just runs right in time. That was, I feel like that was kind of scary. <gasps> Trying to, for the Mega Koopa. Oh my god. This, sorry, this is so intense. No, this is my intense goodness. right now, but he puts the Mega Koopa on the lip there. The jab is going to kill. Yep. Boxes him out of here. Good game to Taternator there. That was really close. That was looking real solid for a long time <laughs> there. Or Zenodo tried to bring it back towards the end, but it was a little bit too late. Too little, too late, rather. But, you know, we saw it, it was a pretty close game. Tater managed to <laughs> get it, but we could see, you know, a game three if it keeps up like yeah. it did. Might see a game three, might see a character switch uh, from Zenodo here if he's not feeling Palo, but I feel like he might stick because that was so close. It was so and close. And maybe he just, you know, there was a few mistakes that he yeah. made and he feels like he could just take it right back and take this game. Yeah, and <coughs> it is going to be still the Palutena versus the Wendy. All right, two chicks <laughs> going in for game two here. Um, <coughs> let's see how they're going to start it off. All right, gets the fair. Amelia, responsive dash attack, though, from Zeno. Gets another one, gets the auto radical as well. Right now, he's just playing the camp game against Tater, and it's working out pretty well for him. But Tater gets one good Mecha Koopa Mecha conversion. Mecha Koopa, the up air. <coughs> just good percent, too, <coughs> for Wendy. Um, ooh, trying to go over that down tilt at the ledge, but the ledge defensibility. Great job right there. Gonna just get the Mecha Koopa in hand. Gonna try and get some sort of conversion off of it. Doesn't catch the landing, though. Smart for him to throw up the Mecha Koopa in the air. So stopping him from jump, uh, for Palu to jump up, um, keeping him, forcing him to stay on the ground and limit the options that Palu has. <coughs> yeah, right now Excuse it me. looks like Zeno's kind of figured out Taylor's antics with the, uh, with the forward air in the back air. Thank you so much. <coughs> Ooh, oh, the going runoff off. Nair is going to be able to get that stop. Wow, yeah, this is looking like a completely different game here. Zenoda really just <coughs> taking really his taking time. Right now. Mecha Koopa, he, it's still in his hand. Is it good? Detonate? No. I to actually catch it with the air dodge, but not going to find it. <coughs> All right. See if Tatum it. Ooh, Ooh, yep. Late fair into the jab. It. That's gonna be enough to kill. That looked like such a good conversion there. I and Tatum are actually doing a pretty good job of keeping it even. You know, he was only down about 10%. He lost one more, two more uh, exchanges though. <coughs> oh man, yeah. See, Wendy's having a really hard time getting back on the stage. So that was kind of calling out his options here. And the explosive flame that was really smart because he knew all he could do was up be there. Oh, and the air the up, or the up air rather can't land on him like that. And this is trying to look real convincing for Zenodo here. Down tilt forward, we're gonna see that into dash attack. Oh my gosh, oh, this is a completely different game. Zenodo's kind of all over him, um, just not letting Wendy breathe. Yeah, we're all just gonna keep on seeing those down throws to forward air there, Palu and her setups. Tries to get the two frame with the forward smash. Not going to find it. Runs across stage with the side beat. Going to actually just be able to catch Zenodo's landings right now. Looking good, but not good enough. The nail coming out again from Zenodo. Nail again. Yep, Tater nice. not going to get a play game two. Ooh. Do you not have a jump? He must not have had a jump. He still could have upbeat, though, so I don't know. I don't think upbeat would have reached. I think he expected to jump, and it was one of those things where... Your brain doesn't quite register yeah. away. I'm not Maybe jumping. Maybe he didn't realize, yeah, he had the jump, or he just knew he wasn't going to recover, so he just let it happen. Yeah. I, you know, <coughs> FD looked real hard for Taylor. I'd like to see maybe him able to catch some platforms. Um, you know, maybe able Definitely. to land a little bit easier, because it looked like Zeno was just not letting him land. Yeah, Zenodo wanted that flat stage. <coughs> no platforms in that. So Palo could just be right up in his face, and... Um, once again, Taternator needs to create space and needs those platforms to utilize those platforms for uh, Bowser Jr. Wendy, excuse me, um, having a little mecha coop up there, switching up um, the options that Zenodo has as Palu. But I all right, looks like he's yeah, he's really thinking about right it. Now. Yeah, really thinking about it. Is it going to be Battlefield? Mm -hmm. Probably. I, wouldn't I think be he's thinking the same thing we were with the platform. Okay, gonna have the one giant platform instead. Still a good option, I think. Yeah, definitely. Definitely think that platform is gonna help um, Wendy out for sure. <coughs> and and the stage, the ceilings, smaller yeah. as well here, so you can get those percentages, 
for those percent kills that he needs. A little lower. So, let's see what happens here. Alright, good pressure, but not enough to do anything really. And three nails coming out from Zenodo. Alright, using... Ooh. Gets the up air, landing up air. Wow, yeah, four, just five. juggling him with those up airs there. Using his magic wand to cast the spell of stay above me. Ooh. Wasn't a bad F smash there. No, it wasn't holding shield. Though. So strong. Good damage output, too, as well. <clears throat> wow, I, I didn't even see the Mecha Koopa up there. That was actually really smart. <clears throat> I Now, one thing I want, like, Tato Day has been going for these F smashes at ledge a lot, but one big mechanic change in this game is that get up attacks are just fully invincible now. Mm -hmm. So if you know there's an active hitbox or you see them charging at the ledge, you could just get up attack it for free and it will always beat it. Exactly, yeah. But these players are both just kind of paying, slowing down uh, the pace of the game here, um, <clears throat> and really just trying to react off of some, one of their oh. mistakes. Did he just up be in there? Was no, that no. There, um, when you up be out of the Koopa cart and you press an attack, you have a special oh, that hammer there, swing yeah. uh, that you can do out of it. And he's real strong. Gonna able, gonna be able to get that stock off as a Noto. And right now, Terra with a bit of a lead, but he's not looking too healthy. Oop, there. That? Yeah. Wow, okay, that killed. <clears throat> Looked like he was gonna live that, actually. But all right. Mecha Koopa doing its job there. Ooh, jab pressure? No, not gonna keep him in shield. There's no gonna roll behind him. Oh, he was trying to read. And I like that he's option. using these safe aerials and then whiff punishing a, a shield grab attempt with the side B. Alright, super patient. Yeah, see, Tater is playing a lot more patient here. Yeah, definitely kind of respecting the hitboxes. Yeah, boxes. he's respecting the hitboxes. No, he wants those nair that nair that he keeps on uh, getting off. Oh, but tries for the boat smash. Yeah, he's staying at the ledge. All right, Smashville looking like it built a highway all of a sudden. Taylor Nader just back and forth across the stage. I so oh, that was good. That was so good because now when the Mecha Koopa hits you, it sticks to you. So if he's able to get that grab and then the Mecha Koopa comes in, he forward throws you and the Mecha Koopa goes with you. And will stay with him. Yeah, exactly. So he throws you out to the blast zone and then all of a sudden the Koopa explodes while you're in the blast zone. Wow, forward air. I thought, I knew it wasn't going to kill, but it was pretty close to killing there. One more and I think that will take the stock off. Ooh, of dash tech, not going to kill yet, but almost killing off the top. This is very crucial. Lowry gets off the legend with the yep. forward air kills across the stage. Yeah, definitely uh, <laughs> with Wendy at max rage here too. Uh, forward air is definitely going to take it. Oh, oh, and that's it. That's it. That was sick. He kills him at zero. Wow.